We at the Slow Maker Space, just behind Trader Joe's in San Luis Obispo, are all about learning and innovation. So when we saw this electrical bill, we thought, holy cow, how can we reduce the bill? Wow, an electrical bill for $731 for the month of July. Well, a significant part of the cost is due to the energy used during peak load. The largest part of our bill comes from demand charge. This 16 kilowatts of electrical power is the maximum power that we drew for one moment during the entire month. This is certainly going to be in the middle of the day when all of the electrical appliances are being used. So it's likely that as much as $100 from here and $100 from here come from using the air conditioning. We've got to find a cheaper way to cool the makerspace. Well, how about the four skylights? They're huge. When I went up on the roof and opened this up, my face was greeted with a rush of hot air coming off the top of the makerspace, the very hottest air in the makerspace. That hot air exiting pulled cooler air in down below, creating a natural ventilation. We leave the screws on this side in, but loosen them somewhat and it acts as a good hinge. Okay, very important. Please notice this wire. There it is in black. That wire is there to connect the framing of the skylight to the roof so that a strong wind coming in this direction won't blow off the skylight. There was a breeze in the makerspace and we have no need for air conditioning. However, what about if it rains? We need to be able to open and close them from the inside. So we get straight to work making some guides that are controlled by the ropes. Again, please notice this safety wire right here that attaches a skylight to the roof in case of wind. Hey, Rich and Brittany, you feeling warm there? Uh, so hot. How about you, Clint? Yeah, there you go. If you just hold that right there. Yeah. Okay, yeah. now if just oh, we could oh. lift that skylight up like this. Would that be nice? And then, the, oh, I can feel a breeze coming in already, oh, man. Already cool. Keep great. doing it. Oh, man. Oh, that's great. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh look at that, man. Is that toad so cool? Actually, or a lot cooler. We can see that the string goes through a pulley to the bottom of the push rod. And so when we pull this string, the push rod pushes the window up and we let off the tension in the string and the skylight comes back down. And here we have the electrical bill for August, the next month. And we can see right here that we saved about $200. A good portion of it was a demand charge, which is down to 11 kilowatts from 16 kilowatts, as well as a significant reduction of the peak electrical charges. It's true that some of this reduction in cost was due to a greater consciousness of when the lights were on and the use of other electrical appliances. But the majority of the cost very likely is because we no longer run the air conditioner because we don't need it. The open skylights adequately cool the makerspace. This innovation may save us up to $2,000 a year and it costs us well under $100 in parts. Additionally, it makes the atmosphere in the makerspace so much more enjoyable with the increased natural ventilation. So do you got skylights? Open them up. Remember to turn off the lights and anything that isn't necessary. And by all means, visit the makerspace. We're having a lot of fun.